So what had happened was I was in New York, and I met um, one of my dear friends who I'd gone to school with, uh, Melina Root. And so um, she was a she was at Juilliard as well, and so was I. And, and so then um, I left to go to LA for about a year, and she stayed here. And um, I was trying to figure out what I wanted to do while I was in the LA, and. Um, she had just been hired as an assistant on Saturday Night Live. Lauren Michaels was coming back. They had a whole new design department, and they had just hired a new designer from the Yale School of Drama named Pam Peterson. <laughs> and Pam had hired my friend Melina. And she was like, look, I'm working on the show. You should come and do it. Um, we want, we need a guy to come. You, it would be great. And I was like, ah, do I want to live, live, like, I'm in LA, it's the sunny life and all that sort of stuff. Uh, ultimately, I was like, okay, sure, fine, I'll come back. And so I moved back, um, not really knowing what Saturday Night Live was. I didn't, uh, like, I feel so stupid <laughs> saying this, but I, I didn't really, I grew up not really knowing what Saturday Night Live was. I, I sound like an idiot, but um, it wasn't on my register. Like, um, uh, the first sort of, reference I heard of it was a friend of mine who I went to grade school with. He wanted to do a class project um, and we were in ninth grade at the time and he was like, there's this new program and they do the they, they do this thing called the fake news and the weekend update. So we're going to do our project like that. It was like a current events thing. I was like, okay, sure. Um, and that was kind of the first time I heard about it and, and I just sort of went on my way, merry way after that and then sort of heard again about it like in I was in college and it was like 83 and we were sort of I think it was the Madonna Madonna was you know so we had to stop what we were doing and watch the Madonna thing and so there were like little moments here and there about doing SNL but um, it never really was on my register and I think partially because also I thought as a costume designer, you do theater. You know, there wasn't, what is, what is the TV aspect of, of doing costume design for theater, for television? Um, and ultimately, um, after I said yes, I came back and was here for three years. She left after one year, I think one or two years, I can't remember, um, to go to Yale School of Drama. So then you go to the Yale School of Drama. So then I leave <coughs> um, and go up to the Yale School of Drama and I'm there for three years. And um, by this point, my friend Melina had um, come back to Saturday Night Live and had taken over the design job here. And um, she's the third year, I'm a first year. And um, she comes back and, and uh, I'm up there and they're trying to make me a set designer. Um, and so I was doing a lot of set design work and costume design work and, and um, I graduate and then I kind of have to figure out what I'm doing. Am I coming to New York? Am I going to California? I'd been offered a job um, with this designer. Her name was Rita Ryak. Rita, I mean, she's done a lot of big things like she did Casino and uh, she worked with De Niro a lot. and. Um, she had called to, and I had known her, um, and she had called me to work with her on a De Niro film that he was in and directing, and I wish I could remember the name of it, um, but I can't. Um, and so I was contemplating doing that, and then my friend Melina called and said, hey, why don't you come back and work on the show? And I was like, well, well, I've already done the show. Why? <laughs> Why do I want to come back? Um, she goes, look, here's the deal. I'm going to leave in a, a couple years because her husband lived in California. And so she was like, I, I need to really be in California with him. And that's where my life needs to be. And I'll, I'll be here for a couple years. And then you can take over the job. I was like, well, I'll do that only on the condition that I can like leave and do my own projects and do theater pieces because it's sort of like why go to school to become a designer if you know I'm going to come back and assist for a couple of years. So um, she made good on her word and she left and um, 
I was doing other projects and so ultimately got to the point and I got a call from the office to sort of be like, hey, Lauren wants to talk to you. So I was like, oh, okay. So I came in and talked to him and it was like, well, do you want to do the job? <laughs> I was like, yeah, I want to do the job. He goes, okay, great. So let's do it. Um, and that was what, 20 some odd years ago, a long time ago.